scare him good. That'd do it. Scare him right in the kidney. Okay, well, I gotta go. Nice seeing you. Stop by anytime. Hi. I hope that you are doing very, 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 very well. Tonight, we're going to play Some Night in the Woods. I played this in its entirety when it first came out in early 2017, I think it was. Uh, and I've missed it terribly ever since I finished it. I feel like it's definitely one of those games that just has such a strong feeling. Um, just beautiful uh, art style, awesome soundtrack. And just like a very ooky, spooky, mysterious, and nostalgic kind of feeling that I love. So I'm super excited to be playing it again. I have a terrible memory when it comes to games and movies and TV shows and things. So I definitely don't remember most of what happens in this game. But I remember enough to know that I loved it. Hi. Hello. Casey Hartley came by in his dad's boat, and I laughed when I saw him. Granddad left me an apple crate of books. He loved ghost stories, and quoted them to himself in the hospital bed. In their wings, in their trees, all things die, be at peace. On his last day, he sat up suddenly, and stared bug-eyed through the window. at the old trains rattling to somewhere else from somewhere else he turned to my dad eyes still wide this house is haunted he said and died well this is great i mean i didn't expect a party or anything but i figured someone would be here welcome home may Excuse me, but where is everybody? It's 10.45. It's closed. Not a lot of folks getting off the last bus to Possum Springs these days. Just you. Isn't there supposed to be someone at the desk? Closed. Why are the lights on? Why is the TV on? I get spooked when I'm here by my lonesome. Oh. Can I squeeze past you? Nope. Just broke the damn thing. When do you think it might be done? Right after you go grab me a fiascola from the machine. Am I paying for this? I always rig it when I'm here after hours. Nice. Free as in free? Free, as in no one's here to say otherwise. How's that door coming? How's that soda coming? All right, off we go, I guess. Oh, let's see. Wow, when did they put this up? Possum Springs has never looked more falsely advertised. It must be such a relief to pay phone companies that Possum Springs gets zero cell reception. It'd be cool to call my parents, but some jerk hole took the time to actually rip it off. Who steals a phone? Alright, let's grab that soda, shall we? <laughs> I love how this game is all stuck like this. Alright, I'm about to call up. Now off to deliver. Hopefully get out of here. One free ass cola. That's one way to do it. Yummers. So, what are you doing here? Reminds me of 
my chick went, what are you doing here? I live here. Well, lived here. Huh. Strange. When do you think that door's gonna be finished? Now. Goodbye. station is maybe the newest thing in Possum Springs because they got state funding or something it makes a good first or last impression I suppose if not for the abandoned glass factory back there nature. Dank nature and garbage. Are these food? Are these, are these food donkey shopping carts? That's on the way across town. That's dedication. There used to be an old sawmill around here, I think. I mean, the park up there is called Sawmill Park. Looks like they lost a log load at some point. <sighs> Gonna have to climb this, I guess. Shopping bags are little ghosts of grocery stores, haunting everywhere else. Oh wow, I heard a toad. And a ghost owl. I bet there are any number of potential witch familiars down here. I hope you guys don't mind that I do all of the dialogue options. I just think that they're really cute. Oh, I remember this took me an embarrassingly long time. I think I had to Google it. <laughs> Oh my god. That was dangerous. I could have died. That was amazing. I am not gonna die in this hole. Up we go. Up, 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 up. Oh, oh. Got our short little legs. It's tricky. <laughs> I love those glowing windows in the background. been here in maybe 10 years, and apparently no one else has. I don't know what they were going for here, some sort of boat castle? Most of it's gone now. Just a thing for weird animals to eat and have babies in. I wonder what kind of weird animals have babies in there. Dirt possums, night snakes, mystery beasts of all shapes. I remember Kathy Domingo's boyfriend took her here to make out and then break up. And then the next day, Kathy pulled out Cindy Clark's nose ring at the F Fort Lucene Mall. This entire area is so full of romance. Okay. Looks like the ladder's gone. If I could just get to the top of this thing. Ugh. I could never make it up onto that tree when I was a kid. The number locks mocked me. The locks and the other kids. Let me see if I can visualize this. <laughs> hmm. Mm hmm. Can't stop running while I do this. Not even for a second. Gotta have enough momentum. I think I can do it. Run and jump, jump, jump. Oh god. <laughs> Maybe I should just give up without even really trying. Hmm. I haven't even tried it once yet. <laughs> okay, hopefully I can get this. Oh wait, oh wait. I'm probably gonna have to do this like 50 times and cut them all out. Do you guys think I got it on the first try? Oh. <laughs> okay, okay. 
Here we go, here we go. Second time's the charm. I don't know. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, third time's the charm. That's, yeah, that's it. Here we go. Okay. Okay, cool. It's only been two years since I lived here. Not in this playground. Possum Springs, I mean. This is all getting jumbled. I should write it down. <laughs> Your parents forgot. should the police officer have? It's a lady, I think I remember. Uh, hello, May. No. Hello, May. Hello, May. Been a while. Hey, what are you doing out here? Nothing better to do. I was out here doing my rounds and I saw you in the very off-limits playground. So, get in the car, May. No. You want to spend your first night back in jail, May? No. <laughs> oh, we're back home. Hey, remember me? Ah! May, you gave me a heart attack. Good. What are you doing? <laughs> oh... May, honey, we thought you were coming home tomorrow night. You thought wrong. How did you get here? I walked until I got arrested by Aunt Mall Cop. Oh, did you say hi to Molly for me? No. I say hi for no one. F the cops. I'm going to bed. Is my bed still here? Why are we waiting for tomorrow night for that, too? Ah, oh, May. So good to hear that voice again. Good night. Uh, I guess Mom's not downstairs yet. Alright, up to bed we go. Do what you do. Oh, nope. <laughs> yes. There are a few things, there are a few things hanging around in here from the old guy. goes off randomly every month or so. A little wooden duck pops out makes the weirdest sound. Scares dad half to death every time. Used to joke it was granddad getting even with him from beyond the grave. Oh, no, no, no. Alright. I'm so bad at this.
Hi, Mom. Welcome home, sweetie. Thanks for not changing the locks. Sorry we mixed up the day you were coming back. It was such a short notice. It's okay, Mom. May, honey? Yeah? Is everything okay? What do you mean? Honey, did something happen? I just needed to come home. Well, sweetie, I think you can understand my worry. It's not usually something the fall of sophomore just up and does. I know. Honey, you could tell me if something happened. Mom, I'm fine, really. Can we talk about this another time? Sure, honey. It's okay. Thanks, Mom. I bet you your old friends will be happy to see you. You wouldn't happen to know where Greg is, would you? Oh yeah, Greg's working down at the Snack Falcon up in town center west by the Click Clack. I think I'll run over and say hey. Well, have a good time out there. Lots to explore. See what's changed. I will. Just watch out for all the construction. Well, it wouldn't be fallen possum springs without loads of construction. It's so festive, honey. I'll be back later. Hi, sweetie. Dad looks old. Mr. Twigmire. Me? Is that you? Sure is. You home for a visit? No, I'm home for good. What? They not have college anymore. Nope, it burned down. Well, I'm sure you burned it down. These allegations, Mr. Twigmire. I ain't alligating. Just try not to burn down. Just try not to burn my lawn down, you firebug. No promises. Selmers, what are you doing home? Dropped out. Wow. Yeah, I guess. So, like, you just don't go back? That's about it. Weird. So, how have you been? Okay. Me and Dennis split. Oh no. Yeah, he got a job at the new prison over in Brittle, and he met some girl at a gas station. Wow, what a jerk. Yeah, he's a free agent. I guess. I love talking to Selmers. <laughs> What's that word they use for, like, a weapon you make in jail? A knife? A shiv? I hope Dennis gets shivved at work. Just to scare him. Scare him good. That'd do it. Scare him right in the kidney. Okay, well, I gotta go. Nice seeing you. Stop by any time. <laughs> Let's see. He's up here. Hello? What you doing on my porch? I guess that's it. Okay. <laughs> hey, Mr. Chazakoff. Hello, May, my best worst student. Uh huh. Yeah. Liked the constellations, hated school. Hey, don't knock school. School is vital for your future. What are you doing back in Possum Springs? I dropped out of school. Oh. Well, if you're still interested in constellations, come by my roof down the hill later this week. Should have my new telescope set up by then. Sure thing. Okay. Do, 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 do. There's those little kids. Hey, it's the Harley. What are you doing? Little Joe, you're under arrest. Oh, wow. Kids still talk about little Joe? We used your DNA. <laughs> uh, ghosts don't have DNA. Yeah, ghosts don't have DNA. 
Hey, lady, can you leave us alone? Yeah, leave us alone, lady. Lady? <laughs> can I talk to this dude? No. Okay. Mind your own business, I guess. Danny, right? Yep. I think you were a senior when I was a freshman. Probably. How's it gone? Just lost my job. Oh no. They say construction's always hiring, but it's not. In fact, it's often laying off guys named Dan. What are you gonna do? I'm open to suggestions. Um, <laughs> I'm sure someone in town is hiring. I've been out of work for a year before. And this time I only lasted six months before being laid off. Do you know what that does to a resume? Not really. I have a zombie resume. It's dead, but somehow it's but somehow it's still going all over the place. Oh. <laughs> I don't have a job either. Oh man, sorry to talk your ear off about it. How are you holding up? Good. Just dropped out of college and I'm living with my parents. Oh, so you're basically a teenager again. No, I'm just an adult living with her parents. Oh, okay, so it's not like you're unemployed. It's like you're lacking a daytime hobby that pays money you don't need for rent. All right, I'm, I'm gonna get going. Yeah. what's down here. Trolley side news. Pretzel pearly. Hey, I just got back in town, and the one thing I missed most was... Hey, I remember you. Hello. Thief! Oh, come on. That was years ago. Once a thief, always a thief. Alright, you know what? <laughs> this isn't even a restaurant. It's a crappy this establishment has been in business for 50 years. 50 crappy years in a hole. You know what else has been in a hole for 50 years? Dead people from the 60s. No respect. No respect to this one. You can keep your whole pretzels and your damp crogies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go jump in the river. Jeez. <laughs> oh my god, we have the option to steal something. Steal a pretzel. Delicious pretzel. <laughs> Oh, I don't think I want to jump out the other end because I don't want to skip a bunch of town. I want to walk through all of town because it's all so picturesque. So let's come back out the way we came. I don't want to take the shortcut. I love how there's the cars bouncing on by. Hey, killer. I don't even know about the killer thing. It was a big deal, even to us middle schoolers. the middle schoolers say. You put him in the hospital, and no one knows why. Did he, like, have it coming or something? No. Our mothers told us not to talk to you, because no one knew when you were gonna do it again. Well, say hi to your mom for me. She sounds lovely. Oh, she's gone. Oh, sorry. It's fine. Yeesh. <laughs> okay. Too bad you didn't catch a flesh-eating disease. Too bad you didn't join a murder cult. 
Too bad you didn't lose all your limbs in a freak soda machine accident. God, it's good to see you. <sighs> How's Angus? You do still a thing? Hold on. I don't know what kind of voice to do for him. What are you doing? Changing the music. does your bass parts. Well, I understood them as the bass parts, but I can turn them off. Turn them off on your computer. May we're totally gonna play song. You totally have to play bass. I don't even remember. Those aren't even drums. Oh. <laughs> Do I just hit the space bar? Oh, no. It's this. Oh, jeez. Pizza isn't great. It's pretty horrible. Dudes, haven't you ever heard? Haven't you heard of the pizza scale? The what? There's a scale of pizza. On one end, there's the worst pizza, but like everything right above that is still really good. What's at the other end of the scale? It's pizza all the way up. Pizza good. Casey. Oh, yeah. You wouldn't know, huh? Casey's gone. Gone. Gone out. Off the train, I bet. Oh, wow. He always talked about doing that. Yeah, one day he was just gone. Made a clean break. 
wasn't emailed or anything. Well, good for him, I guess. His parents put up missing person posters, but everyone knew what happened. Jeez, Casey. I... Wow. Mm-hmm. And what exactly do you do, May? I was in college. And why exactly are you not still there? Didn't work out. Huh. Imagine that. Working out the old pickaxe. Yep. Are they training you to take over the family business? They, um, your parents. <laughs> hey, look, we're here. Oh, my house actually is not for a few blocks. Get out. Okay. Uh, thanks for the ride. Go. Listen, May, I'm sorry about last night. I really thought you were coming home tonight. <laughs> it's okay. Went through the ravine by the old mill. Almost died. What? Yeah, logs almost killed me. Normal stuff. Well, I promise you I'll never leave you stranded again. Tell you what. How about we pretend I did come home tonight, and we just got back from the bus station. Start over? Yeah. Okay. Hey, Dad. Hey, May. Thanks for picking me up. Welcome home, May. I'm going to go to sleep, I think. Well, you've had a big day. Good night, kitten. Oh, wait. I forgot to tell you. What? We found an arm on the ground today. Are we still pretending it's yesterday? No. We came out of the click-clack, and there was an arm. Just like... an arm? What? Aunt Mall Cop came and everything. Oh my god, that's really weird. I poked it with a stick. Okay, really, I don't poke dead body parts with sticks. Too late. Wow, I'll have to email Molly. Alright, good night for real now. No mom in the kitchen. I guess she's only there in the morning. Bedtime? Yes. Okay, so that's it for tonight's uh, playing Night in the Woods. Let me know if you guys would like to see a series of this. If you want, I can do a series, you know, playing through the whole game. Yeah, I really hope you enjoyed. Thank you 
so much for watching. I had a lot of fun with this. I love this game so much, and I've definitely forgotten enough of it that it is just as fun to play through this time as it was the